we're gonna have a little bit of fun. We're gonna make a chemical called nitrogen triiodide. Nitrogen triiodide is one of those really simple chemical explosions that you can make and anybody can do it. Now the first thing you're going to want to do is go on eBay and you can order up some cheap Chinese iodine crystals. I'm pretty sure there's other places you could find it but on eBay I was able to get bottles of it for like less than ten dollars less than twenty dollars depending upon how much you want. The next thing is even easier clear ammonia which you can buy at your local dollar store your local key food Walmart whatever. Easy things right? What you're going to want to do, take a plastic cup, like we try not to use glass when explosions are involved because you don't want glass flying up in your face. But anyway, you take the iodine crystals, pour them into a plastic cup, and then you take your ammonia and you cover the um, iodine crystals with ammonia. This causes a chemical reaction which forces iodine atoms to bond with the ammonia and it creates the nitrogen triiodide. Now, the problem is, it can't really hold three atoms of iodine. So what happens is, it wants to separate, and the separation that eventually does happen is violent. As long as it's wet, it's safe. But you have to take it out, dry it out, and then it becomes explosive when it's dry. Any touch will cause it to explode. <laughs> As long as your triiodide is wet and kept inside the ammonia, you shouldn't have any problem with it exploding. It's only when you separate it and you dry the crystals out that they become extremely volatile. So if you do test this at home, exercise safety and care. Whoa, Jesus Christ. <laughs>